Good evening, parents and students. This is Miss Gross coming at you, teaching you how to do multiplication with set models. So with a set model, if we have, oh, that's my eraser. If we have one number times another number equals the product. Our first blank represents the groups that we're going to draw, or the circles. Our second blank represents the dots or the items that go in each. We'll write items instead of dots. A lot of our friends like to draw dots in them, but um, the correct term is items. The items that go in each group, and then our answer is always called our product. So if we wanted to do a simple problem like 9 times 3 equals blank. We would draw nine groups. An easy way to do that is circles. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And if we have nine groups, we're going to have three items in each. So we'd like to do dots. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. So this is a great uh, pictorial representation of multiplication um, for our students. So they can see that if you have nine groups with three items in each, they can count how many dots they have to get their answer. So we'll count it together. So we have 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. So we see that 9 times 3 equals 27. Now, if we were given a picture and had to find an equation from that picture, let's say we have 1, 2, three dots with one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five dots in each. We know that our first blank is our groups, our second blank is our items, and our third blank is our product. So we see that we have one, two, three groups in each group we have one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five dots or items in each group. And if we counted them all together, 5, 10, 15 is our product. So 3 times 5 equals 15. And that is how you do the set model with multiplication.